Hey y'all, today is Sunday, May 21st, and I am coming at you with just a random video, vlog, full day of eating. It is actually about 2.30 right now. We've had a lazy morning. It's been kind of gross weather here in Pensacola today, and so we took advantage of that by laying on the couch. This morning, I had some coffee with some heavy whipping cream and stevia, and I also had some pork tacos that I put some pork and cheese and sour cream and some big lettuce wraps and they were absolutely delicious. It is now time to do our barn chores. Hopefully I'm going to get to ride today, work on getting my riding back because it is tragic, but I thought I would take y'all along for this fun day at the barn and whatever we get into this afternoon. <laughs> You can't ever pass up a good little keto snack right off the bush. And this little blackberry. Kitty feasting. Oh, bye kitty. Here's our behind the scenes video for our kitten foundation video. We've got our bucket of kittens. Our Don't tools. worry. They're just fine. They're very happy kittens. <laughs> we got our makeup we're going to apply. We are ready to go. So me and Emily just filmed a kitten foundation video. We used our kittens to apply this wonderful face of makeup we have on. It's a silly video. I uploaded it separately on this channel. I'll have it linked down below. Make sure you check it out because it's just super silly and we had fun filming it. I hope y'all enjoy it. We're crazy. Moment of silence for my eyes right now. They look fake. They're so blue. What is going on? I like it. Can they stay this blue every day? Oh, look at those big eyes. Ooh. <laughs> Little kittens everywhere. Little kittens. I am about to ride Philly here. I got my helmet on because Helmet tough. It's very important to always have on a helmet. They have saved my life a couple times. They have saved my brother's life. Even though they aren't the most fashionable accessory, you wear them, save your life. Tip of the day. <laughs> but we're going to hope that riding goes well. It's been a while since I've ridden. Hopefully I don't fall. It'll be a fun old time. Emily will record it if I do. <laughs> Philly wants her air time. Hello there, Philly. We're going for a ride. Mm -hmm. We're gonna try it. I just got off Philly and I have a bunch of clips I can insert in right now to show you my ride. since I've been on a horse but thankfully no no bad things happened I was able to get her to lope I didn't do too bad I don't know my coach might think otherwise but I am a sweaty mess from that helmet but you know it's all good in the hood I got to be on a horse we're gonna start trying to barrel race together she barrel races already I need to learn but we're gonna be the bear racing duo, travel all over Florida, bear racing, stay tuned. <laughs> when I ride, I forget how many muscles that I haven't used in a long time. All these muscles down on my inner thighs from like holding on to the horse, they're already screaming. It's gonna hurt when I walk tomorrow, but you know what? That is a good old leg workout. It's a good core workout. Super excited, y'all. So excited.
I literally have my camera stuck in a bucket of feed right now, but I wanted to note how important it is to drink your water, especially on a day like today where it's like 85, 90 degrees here at the barn. I am sweating profusely. It is extra important to be drinking your water, rehydrating yourself, or you will risk dehydration. When you're on keto, you usually pee out a lot more water. Your electrolytes get flushed through you a lot faster. So water and electrolytes, I think this water has some added electrolytes or antioxidants. It's probably bull, but I like to do maybe sugar-free Powerade or that no salt electrolytes. Keep those up and replenished when I am out here sweating my little booty off. <laughs> Drink your water, people. Drink your water. A fun game we play out here in the pasture is these plastic bats and horse treats and we bat them out into the pasture for the donkeys to find. You gotta make it, you gotta improvise when you're out at the barn. <gasps> it's a really fun game though. Until you, until you're the target. Underhand it. One, two. Dang it! Catherine keeps hitting herself. This is Rowdy. He was a wild boar they rescued. But he's not very wild. He likes to be hand fed. Nom nom nom. Ooh, you want some bread? Want another piece? Oh no, you're not done chewing yet. There you go, bud. Rowdy gets some bread, some corn flakes. He's gonna get some beans. He gets, he eats like a king because he's picky. Rowdy, come here. So gentle. Guys, I didn't mean oh to scare y'all with my boot. It was just yeah, so yeah. adorable. It says yeah. Hi. Yeah, you forgive me. Camera? got home from the barn we spent a good while out there we got to ride play with the baby kittens which were so adorable and we filmed a video be sure to check that one out it's linked down below 
and we just had a fun time at the barn. However, I ate my first and only meal of the day at 11 o'clock and it is now 7.45. I don't think you can see that. That's not in focus. But I am starving. So, it is about time to go fix my second and probably last meal of the day. Since it's almost 8 o'clock, it'll probably be a big old meal because I have sweated a lot. I have worked hard. And this gal needs some food. <laughs> I am going to use a little bit of this zero calorie cotton candy flavor for milk. Just a little serving of cashew milk. Probably a serving and a half or so of cashew milk. Going to do one, two, about two seconds or so worth of flavor. Now we're going to mix it all up and we're going to have some cotton candy milk as a little bit of a treat. My second meal of the day was three eggs scrambled with two slices of ultra thin cheese, some pulled pork with a little bit of sour cream on top, and then just two cups of jello with some sugar free cream on top. Hey guys, so I am rounding off today's video. I hope you enjoyed it. I showed you everything I ate today. Basically, I had two big meals probably under eight on calories today but I'm not hungry and so I am just fine and content my heart is full because I got to be on the back of a horse today for the first time in probably a year and it was just a great day as always please give this video a thumbs up if you enjoyed it subscribe to my channel down below and I will see y'all again real soon with another video. Bye guys.